Hi, I'm Carl from Economy Floor Sanding in Brisbane. Here I have a couple of hoop pine floorboards with borer damage from a recent old floor restoration. As you can see, this one has extensive borer damage. It's been left in a state similar to a honeycomb effect right through. This floorboard has a black marker line drawn across it. This is how we mark them for removal. First, we carry out a test sand on the floor. This exposes the true extent of the borer damage. Before the test sand, the top surface of this hoop pine floor didn't look anywhere near as bad as what you see here. In fact, there was no trace of them visually. Underneath the floorboard, all you could see were these tiny holes, about the size of a pinhead. At first sight, that's the only telltale sign that indicates you have a problem. In extreme cases, you sometimes see pinholes on the top surface of the floor before a test sand. Although rare, in that situation, you could expect to find some pretty extensive damage. This next board is another one removed from the same floor. It shows how borer damage will vary from floorboard to floorboard. This one was also test sanded, although the top surface still looked quite okay. It was showing only minor borer tracks. The side profile shows that in most cases, borers leave a little timber intact on the top surface, although you will still see those tiny holes on the underside. You need to assess each affected floorboard and decide which ones to replace. You can fill minor borer damage on the top surface. This will improve aesthetics and also helps to keep costs down. This is totally left up to the client to decide. If you suspect you have borers in your floors, there are two steps you need to take. First, a visual assessment and then a test sand of your floors. Give Economy Floor Sending a call today. We offer free quotes and free on-site inspections six days a week in Brisbane and all Northside suburbs.